Hi YouTube, um, I've been meaning to record this video and I've actually recorded it twice, but I got interrupted both times because nurses come in and out a lot. So, um, the nurse was just in here and shouldn't be in here for another hour until uh, Abigail's next um, care time. So, I'm going to do this video hopefully really quick. Don't mind all the junk behind me. Um, hopefully you can hear me okay. I'm recording from my phone this time, so hopefully it's loud enough. I am going to be doing a baby haul of everything that I have bought and everything that I have gotten since Abigail was born. She was born 10 days, she's 10 days old, we're on day 11. So, um, I will do that. First, I'm going to start with things that we have purchased. And the first thing that we bought was, we bought it actually, I think the day she was born or the day after. I didn't go with, it was my mom and my husband, they picked it out and I didn't go with. Um, they're just two little preemie hats that they bought here at the hospital. Um, the first one is the one that my mom bought. And if you follow my other sites, you've probably seen photos of her in this. Um, we have to fold it up like this and it's still a little big on her and then my husband picked out this one and you've probably seen photos of her in this one as well and then the next thing I bought was um, a couple days later I went to Fred Meyers and I bought this outfit the first part is this little hat and this is preemie size and if you are on my Facebook you probably saw her in this hat and it's huge on her it's way too big. And then the outfit is this little onesie with a cat on it. Um, some pants, a little kitty feet, and airy gloves, the little feet. And then um, just a sleeper that oh, it says Daddy's Girl on it. And then another trip we went, we were hunting for. Um, more sleepers, and at Target, I got this set. It's the only thing they had. Now, at Fred Meyers, this was the only one they had. They had one outfit, and that was that. And then at Fred Meyers, they had one outfit, and it was this one. Um, it came in a pack of two. They're just, this one's just a plain pink sleeper with some ruffles on it. And then this one with some little, like, bears or something on it. And that's the only thing they had in preemie size, so I bought it. And then we tried Babies R Us, hopefully hoping that they had preemie clothes, and they really didn't. I found um, two sets, the one that I bought and then another one. And so the one that I bought has this little ladybug hat and then a little ladybug onesie with some little pants, just like, this is like set up just like the other uh, cat one. The little ladybugs on the feet. And then um, a sleeper. I don't know why it's on backwards, but it says, I'll take it off. Turn it around. So here's the front of it. And it says, Daddy's Little Lady. And then um, another thing that I bought, this is something I bought at Fred Meyers as well. Just some really little socks. They're the smallest ones I could find. Um, they're still huge on her, so she's not wearing them. And we're trying to regulate, get her to regulate her own temperature, so she's not wearing any clothes or anything yet. And then we also bought her this little bear from Babies R Us. It says, my first teddy. It's small, but it's, like, bigger than she is. Um... If you've seen her one week photo, it's actually one of those photos of her with this. We're going to take a photo every week with her and the teddy bear so you can see her grow. But she's really tiny next to it. So, um, that's everything that we've bought. I've bought some things for me, uh, like nipple cream and breastfeeding stuff. But that's what we've gotten for her, and now for what I've gotten from other people. And I have gotten a lot. 
of stuff. And I am so blessed and so thankful for everything that I've gotten. It's completely amazing. Um, the first thing is my friend Randy uh, brought this little um, dog for her and a whole bag of crafting stuff. So I have stuff to do while I'm here at the NICU and totally bored. Um, and then we got two hats from the hospital. I don't know where the other one is, but we got two hats from the hospital, one like this, and then another one that is uh, just a purple crocheted one. I don't know where that went. I'll probably find it in the pile. And then Heidi made this little hat for her. It's a little big on her, but it fits her pretty well. It's this really cute crocheted hat, and I I love it. <laughs> um, she's so talented, and when Abigail was born, I messaged her and I said, can you please make us a hat because I absolutely love her work. So it's a little hat that we got. And then um, my friend Kat, she got me a bunch of stuff. Um, well, she gave me a bunch of stuff. Some hand sanitizer because we go through hand sanitizer like crazy in this hospital. Um, a bunch of these, three of these uh, their sterilizer bags. Um, she had a baby in the NICU as well, and you go through these. <laughs> you sterilize bottles and breast pump stuff a lot. They say at least once every 24 hours, but I do it like three times. Um, and with these bags, it's so easy because you just stick it in the microwave for three minutes, and they're sterilized. And then she also gave me, um, a bunch of preemie clothes and before I had gotten this care package I had zero clothes in preemie size so it we got a bunch of onesies and they're all super cute um, this is my favorite it's just a pink print and then this polka dot one this little purple dress type one it's really cute Especially because she's kind of a summer, late spring baby. And there's this one. Oh, I love this one too. This is my second favorite. They look so tiny. But they're actually, it would be like huge on her. She would definitely swim in these. So, um, that was really sweet and really generous of Kat. And if... Anybody who's given me anything has seen this. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, and then another follower that I have, um, Amber, she sent me some baby shampoo, which is great because I can, I'm not bathing her yet, but I can use this for her and I can use this for my toddler. And it's great because you go through the stuff a lot. And then she also gave us um, some scratch mittens. Which are really cute. It's just uh, some pink and white ones. And then, oh, here's the hat from the hospital. Sorry, I'm like not more organized. Here's the hat from the hospital, which this is the one that fits her the best and she wears like the most. Often when we take her out to hold her, we put a hat on her. And this is the one she wears the most because it's the smallest. And then my grandma, my grandma came here yesterday and she went to Macy's and she went crazy. Uh, the amount of stuff that she got me from Macy's, Macy's is expensive. Like, I'm blown away by the amount of stuff that she got us. Um, so the first one is this blanket. Uh, this side is just like... Um, a really pale pale pink and it has some a rose there and then on the other side is this print which you're gonna see a lot of this print and it's just a really like thin blanket it's gonna be great this summer and with that came 
this sleeper, these are all going to look huge because I think they're zero to three months. So she's not going to wear these for a really long time. So there's this one. It has like ruffles down it and it has a matching hat with the little flower on it. It's super adorable. And in that, it also came with this one, which is the same style. It's got like this ruffle. And it has a hat, a white hat with a little flower. These are just so girly and so pretty. I love them. And then she got this Carter set, which is newborn. And it's like a sleeper, but it has like the feet open, which will be great this summer. And it comes with some socks and a hat and a bib. And the front is just like that. It's super cute. And it's going to be great. It's this ballerina, light pink. It's beautiful. And this one, my husband loves. It's also a newborn. It's a little shirt with some ballet slippers on it. And buttons up. And then these pants. And this is his favorite part. He loves footy pajamas. Like, he loves pants with the little feet on them. And then it also just came with a plain pink onesie, I guess, to put underneath it. And then here's another zero to three month size onesie set. That's the first print. And then the second one is just plain white. And then the third one is pale pink with that flower again, that rose. So awesome. And then... She got me another set, which is this one. It's all tangled. And this is also zero to three months. And it has this shirt, just a button up shirt, and some pants with the little feet again. Eric loves these. It's super cute. Um, it's kind of like the mint green. And all of it basically matches, and it's awesome. And then. This blanket is like, she also got me a blanket, another blanket, which is just amazing. Um, it's this super soft pink blanket with satin ruffle around it. And the inside is just really soft pink. It's so soft and it's so beautiful. And I absolutely love this blanket so much. So that was all for my grandma and she also brought us flowers but we can't have flowers back here in the NICU so they're out at the front desk and I get to see them when I walk by but um haven't been able to take them home because I haven't been home and I can't bring them back here. But I also got some flowers from her. And then the last thing is probably my favorite gift so far. Um, this is from Kimmy and I've been following her for like ever and She's just an awesome person. Um, and this is also something that's really expensive. And I did not expect anyone to actually get it for me. And I am just so blown away by it. I can't wait. She's TTCing right now. And I cannot wait until she gets pregnant so I can buy her something. <laughs> um, so she bought us the Nuru Skin to Skin shirt. It's a shirt that just, it's like a wrap shirt. And then it has a belt underneath it so that you can not wear anything underneath it. And your baby can be naked and you can just be skin to skin. I don't have it in here because I've tried it on. Um, but it's so awesome. Here's like kind of how it works out. Um, with a baby in NICU uh, and a preemie baby, skin to skin and kangaroo care is like really important. So once she's not all hooked up to the monitors and I can stick her in that, um, it's going to be great. And that's going to be soon too. I'll probably be able to wear her in the next like week, I bet. She just has to get out of the isolate, which is going to happen really soon. So that is everything that I have gotten. My haul it ended up being a long video, longer than I thought. But that is everything. Um, so for those of you who have gotten me things, thank you so much. It's so sweet. Um, it means a ton to us because we, 
I didn't get to have a baby shower because she came so early. My baby shower was supposed to be at the end of um, May. It's like May 25th or something. So I didn't get to do that. And being in the NICU is expensive. <laughs> um, it, it's really expensive. And we weren't expecting to do this. Uh, we weren't expecting, you know, have to pay for daycare and for my son and um, all the medical bills that are piling up and preemie stuff. We had to get a special preemie car seat and, um, you know, preemie bottles and preemie nipples and breast shields and breast pump and breast pump parts and nipple creams and <laughs> everything that is just kind of adding up gas driving back and forth because now my husband, he stays the night every night, so instead of driving five minutes to work, he's driving 35 minutes to work. So it's been expensive and having you guys give us stuff is just so sweet. I have a stack of thank you cards all addressed and ready to mail out. So thank you for watching this. I'm going to do, I'm really behind on her one week update but like so much has happened this week that it's going to be probably really long i'm going to try to cut it down um but i will do her one week update later today i'm gonna run to the cafeteria get something to eat and i will do that later bye